Sybil Wilkes with what you need to know. Today is Thursday, April 4th, 2024. Number one, California Assembly member Matt Haney proposed the right to disconnect bill. This measure is designed to give employees the right to fully separate from employers while off the clock in an effort to prioritize a work-life balance. And by the way, the U.S. ranks 53rd in the world for work-life balance. Number two, a new study reveals that accelerated polar ice melt due to climate change is affecting the Earth's rotation, slowing it down and challenging the assumption of constant planetary rotation. This phenomenon, outlined in a study published this week, not only alters the planet's spin, but also raises concerns about the accuracy of timekeeping systems worldwide. This unexpected consequence of climate change represents a departure from the long-held assumption that the Earth's rotation is a constant beyond human influence. Number three, breast cancer clinical trials often test new ways to prevent, diagnose, and treat the disease. Medical experts in the field say clinical trials are one of the biggest reasons for the major gains in breast cancer survival over the past 30 years. You may be offered the opportunity to take part in the clinical trial at some point during your treatment for breast cancer. So if you're considering a breast cancer clinical trial, what can happen? Find out in today's newsletter. Number four, brought to you by Black Voters Matter. In an ongoing series about the current political season, we understand that voting in local elections can be confusing if you don't understand the role of each office and each official. So today, Coy Malone focuses on the office of the district attorney. District attorneys are elected officials who serve four-year terms and ensure justice in their communities by prosecuting criminals. Their role is vital because they determine appropriate sentencing for criminals. Number five, unlike typical AI narratives about privacy invasion and fake news, a 14-year-old with a passion for tech created an innovative AI chatbot for mental health. TikTok user Sophie aims to counter negative self-talk with positive affirmations and exercises in self-awareness and boundary setting. Although Sophie has not yet made her chatbot publicly available, her creation is just one among hundreds of free chatbots aimed at addressing mental health issues among young people. All right, Sophie. Here's your daily inspiration from Yogi's Jewels. In relationships, being patient is a form of kindness, giving others the space to express themselves fully and openly. Join me today live on YouTube and Facebook at 7 p.m. Eastern, 6 p.m. Central with our mental health and wellness contributor, Aprilette Russell, as we discuss today's top headlines and more. I'm Sybil Wilkes. Be informed. Be empowered.